What's going on, y'all, man? It's L.A. Rich, and we back with another vid, man. And look, we got the one and only Larry Bird back on the channel, man, with another video, and this one being his ultimate mixtape, man. Now, the last video I did on him, bro, was one of him, Um, I think uh, it was just a, a highlight video, and it was more so showing all his passion clips and everything, man. And I say this right now. I did not know Larry Bird was that good at passing, bro. I straight up did it. Um, how he dude was doing flashy passes, I'm talking about, and they all straight up, the he looked at like he was ahead of his time, man, straight up, and to put words most simple, he looked like he was straight up ahead of his time, bro, so I'm definitely excited to see what this video is, because I know it's going to be probably a mix of everything, man, but before we even get into the vid, what I want to say is, thank y'all so much for all the love and support I've been receiving, we have officially hit 8.1 thousand subscribers on the road to 8.2 now. I appreciate every last one of y'all for the love and support y'all show me on a day-to-day -day basis. It truly means the most to me. Nonetheless, we're going to go ahead and get into this vid. Y'all make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know some videos to react to, man, whether it's from um, any, NBA, any NBA player, NBA videos, um, highlights, TV shows, carts, whatever it is, bro. Put it in the comments and I got y'all with it. But, hey, enough of the talking. Let's get into the vid. the most motivated player I ever saw. Larry Bird is one of the biggest trash talkers ever. Larry was a basketball genius. A mask. Look, that's one thing I definitely knew about him, bro, that he was a trash talker, bro. I just seen a lot of clips of him talking trash, man. You know I always got respect for that. Trash talker ever. Larry was a basketball genius. A mask of a hick from Finch Lick <laughs> out as his calling card. And if you believe that for one second, uh, you were going to get beaten. Oh my God. First layup for two. Behind the back. Hey. Hey, you know you a good player, bro, in the NBA when you make the game seem like it's slow. You feel me? Like everything going in slow motion, man. The new player that I can say that's part of the new up-and-coming players is that can do this and that make it like this is a Luka Doncic, bro. He is one of them players, bro, that almost slow down the game, you feel me, to a point where it's like you really think he playing in slow motion, bro, and that's how you're able to tell with a lot of players how good they really is, man. Mm. Hey, hey, he really got an iconic jumper, bro. You feel me? I know that jumper is gonna forever be remembered, man. Real talk, just it looks so. I don't know how to explain it, man. But when you see it, you really a question like. Well, can he really shoot if you was to just see a, see the jumper with no context of who the person is? Nothing, but man, it looked like he actually knew how to shoot with that damn jumper, bro. Oh my god! Oh no, that is disrespect. <laughs> that is disrespectful, bro. Look at this right here, man. Behind it had him looking anywhere for that damn ball. Hey, money though. Mm. What's on the 10 seconds? We'll walk out and Larry say, I'm gonna get it right here, Ed, and I'm gonna shoot it in your face. Gamer. He hit it and looked at me and he was like, damn. I didn't mean to leave nothing on the clock. That's the first three-point contest, he says. I'm just, just looking to see who's going to finish second. This is a tie for the money. Yo! He won a damn three-point contest? Wow. Man, he really won a three-point contest, bro. That is wild, man. That's got, that, that goes to show you, man, hey, 
No matter how it look, if it work, it work, man. Straight up. For the money. Yo! It's absolutely unbelievable. Dominique guarded him, Cliff guarded him, Antoine Carr got him, my guard him. Uh, nothing worked. Bird with eight seconds. Bird on the drive. The runner. Oh, it's good. Good. Oh. Larry Bird is just unconscious. Oh my goodness. Oh, hey. Uh, if you got the other team reacting like that, bro, you know you cold. Look at them on the bench right here. Good again. Oh, Larry Bird is just unconscious. <laughs> Look at all of them. <laughs> uh, he said rainbow uh, trainer's lap. Oh, my goodness. And Bird falls into Joe O'Toole. The guys are into the benches giving each other five. I mean, Bird is a bad man. Bird has 60 points. He would do a head fake. Or he would... Do this, and the guy would turn, and he would just fake the crap out mm. of guys. Larry told all of us and the media, he said, tomorrow night's the last game of the trip, I'm gonna play this one left-handed. And at the end of three quarters, the next night in Portland, he had 27 points left. -handed. Okay, that's disrespectful right there. That is disrespectful, man. If I was the other team and I heard that after the game, man, man, I don't know what the hell I'd do. The dude had made up in his mind that he going to just, hey, I'm going to just play with my left hand this game. And then he go out there and drop 27 on us doing that. <laughs> oh, Lord, well, I'll probably retire from basketball after that. Straight up. Mm. His body was behind the basket and he released that left hand shot. That was his own shot. Oh. oh my goodness. Larry just hit what would have been the game winning shot, but KC called timeout. Larry came back to the bench and you know he was a little upset. He looks at the bench and says, Hey guys, when I come back after timeout, I'm gonna go right to the same spot and I'm gonna kick it in. The ball looks by one. Aims to bird, he gets a good shot in the <laughs> oh, That is cold, bro. You telling me he came out there, hit a shot, coach called a timeout, shot didn't count. He said, I'm gonna go back in the same spot, hit the same shot. Made the shot more difficult. Hold on. Didn't even have to shoot that off one leg, if I'm being honest. Still did it. All net, bro. Oh, my God. He would just flick it or tap it or bounce it to a teammate without even catching it. Mm. Good pass, man. Man, this really make me wonder, bro. Is KD better than Larry Bird, man? I don't know, bro. That's really too hard, man. Because I sit there and look at it like... KD is an amazing scorer. We all know that, man. From One of the top scorers all the time, man. But when it comes in the factor on everything else, realistically, what else is he beating Larry Bird on? If I'm being honest, bro, because I didn't see these defensive clips from Larry Bird. Um, I mean, the passing, rebounding, deep. Like, it, it really make you wonder, bro, is, is he actually better? Is Katie actually better than him, bro? I might say no. If I'm being honest, I could be wrong. And I might need to watch a KD highlights tape just to refresh my memory. Even though I have been watching him, you know, you're on the Suns and everything. You know, I've been seeing him, but I might need to go throw back and see Oklahoma, you feel me, highlights and anything from him. Because Larry Bird looking like he over the top for real when it comes to him versus KD. Oh, my goodness. Mm. I think 
that the Celtic fans, I think that most of the arena and the Detroit Pistons forgot that Larry Bird hadn't quit. Oh my God, if y'all lose. That's crazy. accomplishments and all these things he does, Larry Bird plays hurt. Man, when I tell you I got so much respect for players that play while they hurt, man, especially you see me seeing this right here, cause Lord, it do not happen no more, man. I see people these players sitting out for the simplest shit, man. Like, it really had me wondering, bro. Man, do y'all, I, I get, you know, in, injuries, you know, heal, make sure you better. But when, when, when do it come down to, it's people out there that's going to see you, man. And especially the star players, too. It's people out there that's going to see you, bro. You feel me? So, say a fan pay this much for a ticket and then they get to the game. And they find out that you not playing because your pinky hurt. Like, come on, bro. Get your ass on the court and play this damn game, man. I didn't pay this much for a ticket for my kid or for anything else, but to me to come here, you sitting out from a pinky, bro. And then they using this rest bullshit when they only, look what, like 15 games into the season, man. Get on the court and play, bro. You feel me? Like, shit annoying as hell. And the worst part about it, these players be like 20, 20, 28 years old, 25, and you, bro, you supposed to be in your prime, man. Come on. It's not on the floor. Someone needs to step up now for Boston. And here comes That's what's up, man. Round of applause for him. Of the right cheek. Banger. Ooh, a fadeaway. Mm. Oh, oh, man. Different personalities. Oh, different now I know this was a rivalry right here, man. Larry versus Magic. Hey, two amazing all around players, bro. Let's see what they got. But their value system was identical. Hey. Mm. That is crazy. Mmm. Look at all these people on the court. I couldn't imagine this happening in today's game, bro. All these people storming the court like this. Please welcome now the Irvin Magic Johnson. That's what's up, man. Greatest basketball player ever, but more important, a friend forever. 
That's what's up, bro. I dedicated my life to basketball, and I dedicated my life to the Boston Celtics. My basketball career is officially over, and I had a blast. But the night I leave you, and I say thank you, Boston. Good night. Hey, round of applause, man. Hey. Wait, I ain't. Was that his kid? I did not know Larry Bird got a son. Hey, man. Look, if y'all ain't know, that's the end of it to y'all. My favorite player of all time, favorite player in general, is LeBron. You feel me? So I got a special place in my heart and a love for players who are all around players. You feel me? So seeing Larry Bird on here, bro. Especially since I wasn't able to watch him. I've been watching LeBron since he first got into the league, man. So, seeing Larry Bird, man, just another all-around complete player, bro, is definitely refreshing to see, man. You know, just is great at the game of basketball, bro. He's not great at one aspect, not great at two aspects, bro. Just great at basketball, bro. You love to see it, man. No lie. But, hey, thank y'all so much for the love and support I've been receiving. We have officially hit 8.1 thousand subscribers on the road to 8.2 now. I thank y'all so much for all the love and support that y'all been showing me. It truly means the most to me. Nonetheless, that's when I close out the video. Y'all make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know any type of video to react to, man. I don't care if it's basketball related. It could be any NBA player, um, TV shows, movies. I don't care, bro. Just let me know in the comments and I got y'all with it. But hey, it's LA Rich. I'm getting up out of here. All right, y'all. I still